Good morning, friends. My name is Chris Streeter. I had the pleasure of serving on our bishop staff here in the Diocese of Central Pennsylvania. I'm the canon for mission development and innovation. As you and your community continue living into this season of COVID, I want to invite you to reflect with us in three particular ways. I want to invite you to consider engaging in three sessions, three webinars this July to engage some of the topics, some of the challenges, some of the opportunities that this period of COVID has raised to the surface for many of us. And so on Wednesday, July 8th, we'll be offering a session on our identity, our spirituality, and our temperament as Anglicans, as Episcopalians. On Tuesday, July 14th, we'll be offering a session on mission focus versus a focus on sustainability and maintenance. And on Wednesday, July 22nd, we'll be offering a session on self-differentiated leadership during a season like COVID. And so let me take just a couple minutes now to describe each of these sessions. So on Wednesday, July 8th, I'll be joined by the Reverend Canon Dan Morrow as we dig a bit into what it is that primarily identifies us as a faithful people, as Anglicans. We'll explore, for example, what it is to look to ourselves as a people called to enact God's compassion, God's peace, God's justice in this world. What is it to be identified as a people who love the questions that this world raises for us? We love helping others love questions about God, about our spiritual lives, about life itself. What is it to be a people who relish ritual, symbol, metaphor, and art, who find God's presence in these particular ways? What is it to be a people who don't look for the simple truths, but are comfortable with the myriad complexities of this world? In a time that has felt unstable and uncertain. It is a right and good thing to remind ourselves how we are rooted, where we are grounded as a people of faith. On Tuesday, July 14th, I'll be joined by our Bishop, Audrey Scanlon, and we'll be talking a bit about these two drives that we can find as leaders in our communities. We can find ourselves at kind of a fork in the road when on the one side, we feel God's mission, the way God is inviting us to engage our world, our neighborhood, our community. And on the other side, we can be feeling our desire to sustain, to maintain our community, to keep things the way they are. Often, they can feel like diverging priorities. And so along with our bishop, we will explore how it is we can put aside some of the fears, some of the anxieties that can lead us down that path of sustainability and instead engage with renewed vigor the call of God to serve God's mission here and now in the Diocese of Central Pennsylvania. And then on Wednesday, July 22nd, I'll be joined by the Reverend Paul Frolic, 
Paul is a priest in the Diocese of Central New York and the director of the College for Congregational Development in the Diocese of Rochester. And Paul and I will be primarily looking at the work of Ed Friedman. As leaders in our communities, many of us have found ourselves just bombarded with the emotions, with the sense of loss, uncertainty, perplexity, bewilderedness of those we look to lead. We'll explore what it is to be a leader who can hold all of that uncertainty and yet not feel that we need to take it on ourselves. And so again, for three weeks, Wednesday, July 8th, a session on Anglican identity, Tuesday, July 14th, mission versus sustainability, and Wednesday, July 22nd, self-differentiated leadership. All these sessions will be under 30 minutes. We're looking to, to just prime the pump a little bit, prime the pump for you and your communities, give you some tools to engage in deeper self-reflection. I hope to see you for one, two, or all of these sessions. If you have any questions, please reach out to me. My information is available on our website, diocesecpa.org backslash shaped by faith. My friends, I continue to hold you in my prayers. I invite you to hold me, all of our Shape by Faith teams in yours. God bless. Peace.